Hello and welcome everyone in another episode of Let's Try. We're playing the Stormacer. So in the last episode, I showed you that uh, with my gear, we went like uh, like on every single piece. I have crafted the weapon, the skill, and the attributes. Everything is the same except uh, the mana on a hit that we crafted and mana on kill and stuff. This really helped us uh, with like the mana problem. It's not solved entirely, but it's a big step forward. And in between, I upgraded a few pieces. Like as you can see, I have like plus eight and plus sevens mostly, I believe. Yeah, mostly. And yeah, I recrafted this, I believe, as the epic set. And I recrafted this one. This one is not the best, but I don't have many of the epic fragments, so I can't craft more, and it's kind of expensive as well. However, uh, on the helmet I looked up, and I locked the mana on hit, because that's really helpful. But afterwards, instead of magic item quality, I want to get quantity. But... Uh, it will be okay also if we get either gold or fragment find. Like, both of those two stats could be nice, and even crit chance. But if I want to, like, min-max it like that, that will take a little bit longer. A little bit longer. So, until then, I need to craft more fragments, because I don't have that many. And, of course, I still need to, uh, like upgrade the pieces on higher so yeah like on the weapon we get few more levels but there is nothing too crazy and we also updated the uh, upgraded the temple before but as you can see we are floor 52 i mean whichever can we get prison nope oh oh well i guess we jump here for a bit and Maybe the, uh, oh man, the prison is much better layout. It's like so easy compared to this. Oh wow, have some power here. Oh, it's the ice. Oh, oh wow, we are doing damage actually. Wow, never mind. Nice. Yeah, I love the 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 ice buff. I think that's the best buff. And then it would be like what? Like what? Mm. I don't know. I like the ice first, then probably the fire. I mean, I like the light one, even though it doesn't give you like necessarily damage, but it gives you like debuff on enemies, plus like it has a really nice effect. Light one, like a Jedi. And then. I guess fire just because it deals a lot of damage but uh, yeah other than that uh, I don't know like the other ones like the shadow is like okay I guess but yeah I guess the my favorite one is the ice it freezes the enemies it deals a lot more damage like it's helpful all around as a like as a buff so, yeah, as you can see here, even against like fewer enemies, the mana is not as a problem as it was. I mean, it's still not, we are still not getting more than we are spending, but it's it's much better. It's much better in that terms. And as soon as there's like a few more enemies clumped up together, you like immediately get the mana back. So it's okay. Like now it's kind of doable. Like, of course you can switch it for like your single target setup every time, but it's a little bit... It's not optimal to switch in between the battle and stuff, so... Yeah, it, it, it's, it's okay. Like, not now we are almost there to the point where it's relatively easy to uh, maintain the mana. I mean, it's still kind of hungry, the build, and it probably stays like that until I get like 
few more pieces and a few more upgrades with the uh, within the gear, like for the epic stats, because yeah, the epic stats are what needs to be crafted, but I can't because I don't have that many uh, epic fragments. I think there are fragments, right? Or slormites. But not sure which one now. But yeah, we don't have that many, so we can't like, I don't know, like reroll one item 50 times. There is no way. It's way too much. I don't have that many of those. So I need to like save up or something. Or And that's where the fragment finding comes in. Because if I can get few more like fragment find, and I hope it believes, like, oh, not believes belongs to the to the drops of the fragments like the like all of those all of these I hope are counted in if that's the case then yeah we can like go for the fragment find as well because obviously we need a lot of those for crafting further like until now it was Okay, like we're still doing okay, but soon I kind of want to minimax few pieces here and there to like at least have the good stat and then upgrading it or whatever. I, I can do it later, but just to get like that one good stat, that that's what takes the I guess the longest because you need to farm all the gear which. Not the gear. Like, yeah, like the gear pieces with the right stats and everything. That's what takes eternity, so... Yeah, that's... I mean, it's on the list to do, but it won't be as easy as, like, farming gold. Like, obviously, with, the, like, farming gold, you just hit the enemies, get gold, and you're done for. But with the other, like, with the fragment find, there is no dedicated fragment find weapon or anything. It may be in the future there will be, but until then you need to like rely on the drops to basically like give you the fragments. And it's not every time, so yeah. Maybe with the patch, as they said, they, they might introduce the uh what is it called? The the, uh, the the chests that like give some sort of oh, what is this oh. oh man this sucks uh the the chest that introduces the like the, like weird chests where uh you get all sorts of items depending on like what type of chest it is then yeah that's that's good because you can like find the chest full of like uh, fragments and such it, 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 it can maybe depending on how much of course they would drop like how many items that could be a big big help but we will see that only after the patch even like if it like, I don't even know if it will be in this one that will be coming but they mentioned it might be because it's not a big mechanic but who knows, depends on like how their schedule is with the development of the patches. So let's go one more here and then we go back to the top. Uh, yeah, still for this build, I believe the, the shield guys are the worst. I mean, you can deal with them with this scale, like like this, but it's still annoying, right? It's still annoying. Because you want as much mana, and I don't believe that it gives you full mana when you're hitting their shield. Like, it still gives you, but I don't think it's like the full value. It feels like reduced or something, I don't know. It's just the feeling, maybe. But, hey. I think I can do here. But that obviously we are still stacking mana on hit or like mana leech or something just to make it easier. And we are we are getting there definitely because it I, I can already feel the the change with the ring. 
plus now we got the buff on uh not the buff the, the stat on the helmet as well so it's going in the right direction definitely so if anyone is like i guess making the same build i wonder if you have similar mana problems or if you have entirely different problems with the build like maybe you are missing life leech or maybe you're not tanky enough or like maybe you're not getting as much gold or something obviously this build of mine is still not finished yet there's still so much to be improved and min max and everything but like it's going the right direction right so i wonder if any of you had similar problems or if something else like came in the way of progressing with the build properly you can let me down in the comments or maybe you can give me different ideas even like entirely for gold finding maybe there is something better for different uh, skill or maybe not even just the skill but the class itself maybe some mage gold finding or uh the night gold finding if you have anything like that i might i might like look it up because obviously i can switch gear around and it won't be the best but yeah it's doable i, I mean i don't have the weapons on the night so that would take some time but if you have different ideas for this like uh for the hunter or maybe even a mage then i'm all up for it so let's spend this here. I can do it like twice. Perfect. And yeah, let's spend all the slurm here. Uh, can I? There is one, two, two, three, three pluses here. I see. So let's do that. I guess go so here. But I don't know which one I need. Probably one of those three, right? And we are gonna get upgrades here and there. So the helmet, do this. We can. That's fifteen thousand. Magic item quality. I don't need the quality, but oh, one more time. Oh well. Ah, uh, that was fail. I mean, it wasn't a high chance. So ooh, that's this is no no. So we need higher one. Damn. Nice. Getting higher and higher. And this one. So please give me a lot. Oh. I mean, okay. So I need to level up more gear. And we have 200,000. So how many? Yeah, as you can see, I don't have that many of those but let me exchange a few here and i might i might something here uh, merge and yeah, yeah let's do it let's do it like this let's put them back here and i'm gonna craft on i guess this one here and see if like what kind of stats we get. It's like two hundred thousand, so it's expensive, and we don't have that many of the epic slurmer ones. So what did we get here? Pierce? No mana? No million image? No? <laughs> oh boy. Um, let's reroll here, right? That's a no. Oh oh wow. Okay okay okay. I like the damage to elites and gold find. Yeah, those two are fine. Armor is like, eh, it's a dead stat. Oh, this is definitely doable. So I'm gonna keep that. And, ah, uh, but the scores, scores. I, I wanna get a little bit higher here, I believe. Oh, what did it just, ah, uh, nope. Uh, I don't have enough money though. I can do just once? Really? 
Oh no. Okay, let's reroll the scores here. Please give me higher. No, that's the lowest gold find. Five. I can one more time. Six. I okay, that's that's fine. That's that's okay. I'll take it, I'll take it. Not the highest roll, but yeah, this will take time because you don't have many of those. Okay, is there, is there a way to... No, there... Oh, uh, no. Yeah, there is no way to, like, somehow get them other way than from this. Seems like. So I need more fragment find, maybe? But it's one thing down from the list, so I need to craft one, two, three, and then four, I believe. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, that will take some time, but oh well. I, yeah, the fragment finding that, that that will take a lot of time. So, but I guess it will be between the characters, like when I will be switching back and forth between mage and hunter. Whenever I found farming the gold or higher levels of something with the mage, like tower or something. So, yeah, when I get a bunch of them more, I guess, then I can craft a little bit more. And obviously, since we spend all our gold now, like over 200,000 or 300,000. I need to farm again. I need to get more stuff. But if you have any like better ideas for gold finding, you can let me know down in the comments and I will see what I can do to get it even better. So I guess that's it for this episode then. So thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one.